Hi, I'm Dr. Rasya Dikshit. I'm a dermatologist practicing in Bangalore from the last 15 years. Mold removal surgery has become very common nowadays. The reason why we do mold removal surgery in India and the reason why mold removal surgery is done world over in Caucasians is very different. In Caucasians, the moles are removed usually because they are suspecting a cancer and they want to rule out by removing the mold. And in them, the concept of mold removal is to make sure that they remove moles with at least a centimeter area which is given away from the mold border of the mold to make sure that there is no remnant cancer cell inside the mold. But in India, we are doing mostly mold removal surgery for cosmetic reasons. We want to remove it because we want to appear better. So when we come to mold removal surgeries in India, you have to remember there are many types of molds. You have flat molds, you have raised molds, you have molds which have got uh, hair growing on them. So if you talk about mold removal surgery, it's very complicated. It depends on the type of mold which is there. But if there are small moles which are less than 0.5 mm in size, they can usually be removed very easily with something called a punch biopsy. And once it is excised, a simple stitch is being taken which leaves a very minimal scar which is hardly visible. But if the mole is more than 5 mm in size, then we need to do a more of an elaborate surgery. It may need a plastic surgery, you may need a V-plasty or a W-plasty. Usually when I do lasers for removal of mole, the mole is less than 2 to 3 millimeters in size. We can use a surgical carbon dioxide laser and it hardly leaves any mark when it is removed. But remember that when you are removing a mole, you are removing tissue. So there is going to be some kind of scar. The scar is going to be much smaller and much less noticeable than the mole. But there is going to be some scar. So remember that if you have a tendency to get bad scarring, it's better to go for a test patch of the treatment. If you have a mole on the body, you can get it removed. See the effect of the scar and then go for the actual mole removal itself. I hope this has been useful for you.